it takes for you to be an effective prayer is just to show up and having received from God be able to give that to others. The first question that popped up was, am I qualified to do this? Uh, then uh, God ministered to me that you should remember my grace is sufficient for you. I'm convinced what it takes to be an effective prayer is 1% just showing up and 99% waiting for God to show up. No one's perfect and we provide lots of opportunities to get mentored and to practice and uh, there's no right or wrong way to pray. When I step up in faith to do this, I'm not the one praying but the Holy Spirit interceding for me. And then I get up to the altar and I just realize I don't have any answers. I don't have to be a prophet. I don't have to be hyper spiritual. I have to be um, a conduit and I have to just put my hands on people and listen and love them and enter in with them. Yo, I keep my stance on the rock like this. So if two, three or more decide to lock wrist, you better come strong, faith long than this. Cause with Ritz and CC, you know God in the midst. And I think as people that pray for folks up front, it's waiting on God to do the work and not using your own strength and power and stepping out of the situation and allowing God to minister to a person and allowing Him to do the work so that He gets the glory and not us. I know that Christ is the ultimate counselor. He's the ultimate advisor. And so whenever I know that I step forward, Christ is always going to be the one who steps in and does the work. All you need is a willing heart and let him do the rest. We have altar intercessors that pray with people as they come forward after the service. Then we have service intercessors that are behind the scenes. They're covert. They're invisible. One of the beautiful things about this, and it isn't horribly spiritual, but this is just a few minutes added on at the beginning of, of a service that I'm already coming to and a few minutes added on at the end of a service that I'm already coming to. So as you can see, when you hear the testimonies of all these great prayer ministry volunteers, there's really no reason or excuse for you to not consider becoming part of this team. Our next prayer ministry basic training will be Saturday, May 31st from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. God is moving through ordinary people just like you to touch lives through the altar prayer ministry. We invite you to consider becoming part of the team. For more information or to sign up, stop by the spotlight table in the gathering area.